For people who exercise, the everyday workout is now a high-tech sprint to success. All right, Fox 5's Erica Walker takes a spin and more in this month's Big Idea. I kind of really like it. The ever-evolving world of technology can help us improve our fitness more than ever before. We all need a little bit of extra encouragement to help us reach our fitness goals. And adding in both the, the sense of fun from video game and also the, the power of, of community can help you achieve your goals. The company Zwift, for example, bringing multiplayer gaming technology to indoor cycling, changing your workout forever. And there's your time on the sprint. You can see where you rank with everybody else who's doing it right now. That's right. Zwift works in real time and sets you up against riders anywhere in the world on courses in London, Virginia, and a fictional island. At any given day, there are uh, there are dozens of group rides and races that happen all around the clock. All you need is a bike, an indoor trainer, and computer or tablet to run the program on. The software even pairs with an app so you can interact with other riders, change courses, and set your workouts. If I'm working out like by myself, you know, you're just going to be staying at that cruising level. This really antes that competition level. And while I was on my first Zwift ride, cyclist Alan Rigo has been using the technology since it launched in 2015. And I guess I come at it from like a little bit more of the serious side of things. But I don't necessarily want tools like this to be a distraction to my training. And when I first experienced it, it was much more than I could conceptualize. It actually became like a real focus. It brought some real focus to my training. Rigo most often uses it in the winter when he can't get outdoors every day. Every element is there except for one. You know, that element of just like, steering your bike and bike handling, but like all the physics of bike racing, you know, drafting, watts per kilo, acceleration, deceleration, they're all in it and they're done very well. And with this type of technology, you can feel the ride itself, whether it's the flat roads or those grueling climbs uphill. It's a truly immersive environment and a full riding experience. That's where the smart trainer comes in. It adjust resistance based on the gradient in the game, based on the quality of your draft with other riders, even based on the type of bike you choose to use in the game. There's a lot of things that we brought over from video games to incentivize you to work that a little bit harder, to, to compete against the guy next to you, to work for the, work for the goal in, in front of you. Meantime, in Orange Lit Studios Worldwide, Orange Theory Fitness prides itself on taking the guesswork out of your workout, sticking to science. You know what you have to push yourself to get to. Uh, if I don't give you a goal, you're just going to go through the motions. Coaches like Brendan Bellantoni are there to guide the class through an hour workout centered around technology and your heart rate. We're the forefront of technology-based working out. We, everyone wears a heart rate monitor. You could see your results on the screen as you work out, and that keeps you pushing yourself harder. A variety of screens not only show your exercises, yeah, that's, that's perfect form right there. but more importantly, monitor your heart throughout the class. The goal to get to at least 84% of your max heart rate for 12 minutes or more. A frustrating game though when you can't get to orange. You learn and you how feel to, like you're so working hard. You learn how to push yourself into those zones. The high intensity training is scientifically structured to keep you in that target zone, to spike metabolism and increase energy. Building more muscle creates that EPOC, which is excess post exercise oxygen consumption, which helps you burn more calories when you're not here. And no matter how you get your sweat on, just think of technology as another piece of exercise equipment. Because, like it or not, it's the future of fitness. How are you feeling? Horrible. But it's a great workout, that's for sure. Erica Walker, Fox 5 News.